it's great. Although it is a difficult transition, for we started off as missionaries, which of course is obviously much more apropos. But their mission got in trouble, and that burst their holy bubble. We were caught in an imbroglio, and we finally had to go. So we hope you'll understand if we're not absolutely grand. going to give you the history of our order and you're going to be quizzed on it afterward. Filled with great anxiety, Sister Hubert sailed with me and Sister Robert Ann to a land of unknown circumstance. We reached our destination with a bit of trepidation for we'd come to order lepers back to work in southern France. No, no, no. That's not right. Uh, we'd come to join an order working with lepers on an island south of France. That's it. Each of us as best we could cut a tree and chop some wood, which then was used in building humble huts for quarantine. When Sister Marky Bond had finished up the portage on, we all sat down and waited for the first of those unclean. And they came from everywhere. There were hot and tots with rotten tots and baskets on each mother's head. still alive, her sisters went to pieces at a devastating rate. When a novice spilled her food, at first we thought her rather crude, till we realized her hand was on the floor with her fork and her plate. Wait! There's more. The Protestants, it seems, had set out to wreck our dreams. We had humble huts while they built up for condos by the sea. Competing with each leper put our mission work in jeopardy, so we devised a plan to avoid catastrophe. We challenged them to race, cause we thought we'd trump the race in the hundred meter dash when we'd enter Sister Rose. But as she was victory bound, her schnoz fell on the ground. If it hadn't fallen off, she'd have won it by a once more to survive but this time we knew we were in a truly hopeless spot so we packed up what was left feeling totally bereft we got a while to go and was still able to be got we came back 